27-year-old Maria Soseraj had come to Mumbai to become famous. She did finally, but not in the way she had imagined. She and her friend, Sub-Lieutenant Jerome Matthew from Kochi, a naval officer, were arrested in May 2008 for the gruesome and chilling murder of Neeraj Grover, the assistant creative head of Synergy Ad Labs. Maria, who was in a relationship with Jerome, came to Mumbai in March 2008 to become an actor in Hindi TV serials. She befriended Neeraj to secure a foothold in television industry and subsequently started dating him. On the evening of May 6, Neeraj went to Maria's new home in Malad to help her unpack. The next morning on May 7, Jerome went to Maria's house and was enraged when he saw Neeraj with Maria. He grabbed a kitchen knife and stabbed Neeraj, killing him instantly. Maria went to a neighborhood mall and bought a huge chopping knife and two sports bags. Jerome, meanwhile, chopped Neeraj's body into as many as 300 pieces. His remains were stuffed into one of the bags. Blood-stained curtains, Jerome and Maria's clothing, into other. At 4 p.m., the two drove to Manor Jungles where they set a fire to both bags at a secluded spot. Maria and Jerome were arrested on the 27th of May. And soon after this, Maria had taken the police to the spot where they had disposed Neerad's body. On 30th of May, Maria Soseraj confessed to killing him. In the last three years, the case has seen several twists and turns. Maria's lawyers have been accused of threatening witnesses. And at one point, her family had even said that their daughter did not even know Neeraj Grover. But on Thursday, justice was finally delivered, bringing to an end one of the most gruesome stories of crime in the recent times. With Nilanjana Bose, in New Delhi, Pavan Bali.